Hi, it's Jesse here with another episode of Jesse's Tips and Tricks. Today we're going to talk about uneven audio volume levels. Now what do I mean with that? Well, if an interviewee talks like this on a relatively constant volume, you can just go in Premiere and right click the audio track, normalize to minus one, and boom, your world is beautiful. However, sometimes an interview can have very uneven volume levels. Where the interviewee goes like this, he talks really loud into the microphone, and then he's distracted and saying the most important thing while well, you can't really hear him very well, and then he comes back and then it's very loud again, and it's, uh, you know, it's, it's just, and you can hear some things, and you know, it's, it's, it can be problematic. Yeah. You could try to solve this by grabbing the pen tool and go like this. <laughs> but with a long interview, this might become really time consuming. And we don't want that, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the razor tool. We're gonna hold down the Alt key because we wanna make cuts in just the audio layer and not in the video layer. And we're just gonna make some cuts. Like cut, 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 cut. Go ahead, make some cuts. So we're gonna select everything we've just cut and we're gonna normalize everything to minus one. Because we might now have some rather radical changes in the volume, we're going to select these clips again and press Command Shift D or Control Shift D to smoothen things out. Provided your default audio transition is set to something normal like six or eight frames, or if needed, you can change this under Edit, Preferences, Timeline. Anyway, now the volume of your audio should be a lot more evened out. Just check if everything's okay and you're done. You've dealt with uneven audio in just three simple steps. Cutting, normalizing, and applying audio gain. Easy as one, two, three.